Jacqueline, you know I care about you. I care about us. You can't blame me. I know you too well. Come on. I met her while we were on our break, so I don't know why you're flipping out. Okay, okay. So you don't think she'd get upset if she found out we fucked two weekends ago? Because if I'm doing the math right, you started seeing her a month ago. Don't you understand? We we're on a break. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Listen, I'm just trying to do the right thing here. I didn't do anything wrong. That's what I thought. Deny, deny, deny. Mr. Never mean to hurt anyone. Okay, fine. I'm the screw up. Always the bad guy. I never said you were a bad person. You know how much I care about you? Yeah? Well, you're doing a really fucked up thing to someone you claim to be in love with. You know how I felt about you, how I feel about you. Everything we've been through together in the last two years. I know, but I have to be honest with you. I loved you, but I never said I was in love with you. I need to see where this goes with her. Yeah? Well, I need to be honest with you. I recorded this entire conversation, so I know how these things go. You'll probably tell her I'm some like crazy little girl obsessed with you, right? Well, I found her phone number, her email addy, and I found her on Facebook. Mm-hmm, yeah, and I'm gonna send her this recording in 10 minutes. That's enough time for you to give her the heads up and warn her. And no, I'm not trying to hurt her. I just can't be complicit in you hurting another woman. How you were not only hooking up with me, but now it turns out you're hooking up with other people too? Uh-uh. This is the only way to get you to leave me alone. So don't call me, don't text me, don't write me, don't even fucking breathe near me. Jacqueline, no. Please. I love her. Stop begging. I wasn't kidding. Your 10 minutes start now. Bye. I really care about her. Did you really record that boy? No, I just wanted to mind fuck him as hard as he mind fucked me. So do you think he'll really call her and spill the beans? I know he won't be calling me again. Asshole. asshole. Fucking asshole. Hey, what's up? Uh, Beth is looking for you. It might be urgent. Cool, thanks. Um, I really think you should go right now. You know how she gets. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, I'll be there in a minute. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. How you doing? Me? Spiraling. Oh, Lord. Roseanne's sticking around post-period. Ew, kill her. After you left last night, I cried, I laughed, I cried, I yelled at the TV, and then I knocked out. Wait, wait, no. I also tried to fight the pizza delivery guy. Girl, you've got to tell yourself, I am not my mom or my dad. I want to be happy. I can be happy. I am happy. Things are going great for me. I got rid of that douchebag. Die, Roseanne. Fuck, I hear so too. Be right back. Okay, kill that hole while you're at it. So 
there a Mexican expression for synergy? Um, because <laughs> that's what we're going for here at WIG, but I gotta tell you, it is about to go down the Aldrino Rapido. I need your focus here, Jacqueline. We're about to lose Katie, Emily, and Liz to maternity leave. Yeah, I kinda noticed. Okay, well then trust me when I tell you that shit is about to hit the fan. I'm gonna need you to meet with them starting today to transition all of their projects. I'm so king, Beth, for an all-hands-on-deck approach. I really am. You know how dedicated I am to Women and Girls International. However, I did just start therapy sessions on Monday and Wednesday evenings. And well, therapy twice a week, that's a lot of daddy issues. Listen, Jax, you are a go-getter. You are one of the few people here who's both a true believer in what we do for women and girls around the world and ambitious. Now, I wouldn't be giving this to you if I didn't think you could handle it. And I want you to see it as an opportunity to get to the next level. Or, you know, a test, whatever motivates you more. Now, since we'll be increasing your workload, I've hired that intern that you like so much. She'll be a coordinator under your supervision. Sochi? Yep, yeah, that's the one. It'll be a good match. She's, uh, she speaks your language. Millennial, but also Mexican, of course. I mean, Spanish. You don't think she'll get pregnant, too? I don't think so. Well, at least I don't have to worry about you. So you'll take her with you when you go meet the three pregateers. Okay. Jax. I know you're right for this. Thanks. Fuck my life. What happened? Hello? Hello, you there? Where are you? Mm, this pizza is the one. Right? Jackie, thanks for leaving me hanging earlier. And Rosie, where have you been? What do you mean? I've been G-chatting you for the past few days. What's up with that? I've been busy working. Some of us don't have the luxury to be G-chatting at work all day. Ooh. <laughs> Jackie, what's the good news? All right, spoiler, Elena live chatted the entire thing yesterday, but I couldn't be happier that you're moving on. So you have been on G-Chat, what the? That guy is drama. For real. When are we getting in contact with Paloma? We need our West Coast influencer if we're gonna start. West Coast in the house, chicas. I'm here. Wow, what a winner that guy, huh? Um, so yeah, anyway, Elena hooked me up while you piggies were stuffing your faces. But on the reels though, Jackie, I mean, yeah, let's get it going, girl. Okay, fine, it's not good news, girls. Beth is basically giving me three extra workloads over the next three months. I'm sorry, but we're gonna have to postpone La Provocadora again until next spring. Oh, that's interesting. I mean, that really sucks for you, but I don't understand why we all have to postpone the launch of La Provocadora. Dude, this is her project. Yeah, I know, but I'm overweighting. It's like, let's just go for it already. Every time we make a little progress, all of a sudden something happens. And honestly, it pisses me off to see all of these Latina blogs and communities pop up with ideas that we've had for years. Exactly. Yo, I know I just joined in, but Rosie's right. Put whatever you have up and get that momentum going. That's how I started by myself. But now you've got me plus the three of you. Uh, I'm sorry, Jacqueline, that your boss is a mega bitch. But that's not gonna change anything. Okay, 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 fine. Let me think. Jackie, you know we have your back. Let's just do this shit. Y'all are gonna get me fired. Yeah, good, you hate that job. Yeah, but I like to eat. Who's gonna sponsor our pizza nights and our carne asadas every weekend? Definitely not that asshole boyfriend of yours. Your face? Fine. <sighs> I'll take a sick day tomorrow and figure things out. Then we'll go? I mean, we'll launch soonish. Y'all crazy. Pizza crazy. 